One of the big targets we set is to go 100% renewable. Uh, we've already achieved that in the UK and Ireland um, in terms of uh, electricity, and we're starting the journey in terms of gas. For us, it just makes good business sense. We're working hard to reduce the amount we use. That saves us money. Going renewable, uh, it makes us more resilient, uh, and it's doing the right thing in terms of reducing emissions. So our focus on renewable uh, and energy efficiency covers right across our operations. We've worked really hard in terms of production, uh, whether that's using uh, new technologies, LED lighting, new types of fridges, or just better management processes in stores, turning off lights, pulling down fridges, fridge blinds, um, and, and the way we operate our stores. Uh, alongside that, we're working, as I say, on renewable energy. Some of that's on site. We have the UK's largest single roof uh, solar array on our distribution centre in the Midlands, nearly 25,000 solar panels. Um, but we're also looking at what we can do in store where we have some solar arrays. We did it because it's the right thing to do. But actually along our journey, we've absolutely seen there is a strong business case. And in terms of energy efficiency and renewable energy, uh, ever more so. It saves us money. Uh, it, you know, over the last, uh, last year, Plan A saved us 160 million pounds. Good chunk of that comes from renewables uh, and energy efficiency. So the reason we joined RE100 is um, any one business alone isn't big enough to make a difference. We have to work in collaboration, in coalitions, and that's true of everything we do in sustainability. So we're doing some great work. There are lots of businesses doing some great work. We want to get together, shout about it, hopefully inspire other businesses, share the lessons we've learned along the way, show it can be done. These things aren't, um, aren't as hard as they might seem, and show there is a really strong business case. So I think it's about that strong voice from business, and we think that's really important in the run-up to Paris, having that strong business voice.